Today's game is called Five Pictures, Five Words. Everybody, I made a scoreboard. I'm playing it with my friend Ian Kung. Everybody has been seeing on Twitter probably those AI generated pictures where you type in something into this program called Dolly Mini, and then it spits out a little grid of nine pictures based on the words that you type into the prompt box. Me and Ian made five pictures for each other, and we have five words that we put in the prompt box. And our job today is to guess those words, and whoever has the most amount of correctly guessed words, they win a $5 off coupon to O'Reilly's Auto Parts. Five <laughs> pictures, five words, $5 off O'Reilly's Auto Parts, which is pretty nice of me. Did, so, you, did you go out and buy that, or did you just have that in the house? Ian, I would spare no expense for this game show with you. You're right, and okay. Honestly, I'm a little insulted that you assume that, but whatever. So remember, you guess five words. So Ian, tell me what five words did I type to get this set of pictures? Okay, oh my God. Um, oh, this is easy. Uh, uh, it's like horses in roller skating rink or something. It, it, it. No, 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 it has to be exact. You have to guess exact. You have to lock it in and it has to be exact for the points to count. Sven, there's no, what? Ian, this is my game show. You're gonna come on my game show and tell me my rules. Okay, little, little horse in skating rink. Little horse in skating rink. Final answer. Horse at roller rink. How do I not get the point? You're gonna, you're gonna look at me with a straight face and say I'm not gonna get the points for that? <laughs> He, I want to see the comments. I think Ian, I get points for that. Ian, I literally started with the easiest prompt I have, so this is gonna be a, this is gonna be a rough five pictures for you. Here. Right, fine, then guess my, here, here here's mine. All right, check this one what? out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, go ahead and guess the exact five <laughs> words. Uh, this is where it gets tricky because is do I guess Dwayne Johnson or Dwayne the Rock Johnson? Well, you better get it exactly <laughs> right, otherwise <laughs> you're can't. completely wrong. You complete fucking moron. No, he's like, here are my five words. Dwayne, Rock, Johnson, playing chess. Okay, let's see. Oh, I guess you're completely wrong because oh, you forgot no. the the. I get five points for that. Dwayne, Rock, Johnson, playing chess. Easy first round. All right, that's pretty good. Sven has five tallies. Ian has three tallies. My second prompt right here, it's what five words did I type to get this? Okay, okay. Matthew McConaughey <laughs> eating grenade. Okay, Matthew McConaughey eating grenade suit. Matthew McConaughey, eating grenade suit. Those are your five Come words. On, let's go. Matthew McConaughey holding a hand grenade. Hey, that's pretty good. <laughs> Matthew McConaughey, grenade. Yeah, I'll take three. You get three. All right, are you ready for mine? Yep, all right. Focus up, here it goes. This is gonna take a lot of brain power. <laughs> 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 I'm getting a lot of Boris Johnson and Kermit oh, vibes. What? Right off the bat. <laughs> Looks like one of them is. <laughs> wait, wait, a minute. Oh no, he's cracked the primary <laughs> defensive <laughs> line. It looks as though Kermit the Frog is a security advisor, and he's taking a bullet for Boris Johnson. I'm gonna say Kermit. The Frog, Boris Johnson. There's five words there. Kermit and Boris Johnson at the Super Bowl. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, this is the Super Bowl, boy. Look at this. You know what? I'm going to give myself three as well because I got Kermit and Boris Johnson. After two rounds, Sven is at eight. Ian Kung is at six. Okay, catching up, catching up. Yeah, you're closing the gap. Remember, we got a lot on the line here, Ian. So <laughs> if you win, do you just keep it or... First of all, I'm flattered that you sounded so scared of the prospect of me winning this $5 card because it makes me think that you really want it. Did you just like make up a game so that you could buy yourself an O'Reilly $5 gift card? What? So you're talking about? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> all right, next picture is in the chat. Okay. <clears throat> this one's getting tougher, I will say. This one's tougher. Hmm. So already you can kind of tell a few things. Oh, uh, okay. So I think Danny DeVito has something to do with it. What's this bottom thing? <laughs> at SeaWorld or at on the moon? I'm just going to go Danny DeVito on the moon. All right. <clears throat> Danny DeVito at deep water. <laughs> 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 Come on! What was I gonna do with that? This is so unfair! Where? Where is deep water anything? The bottom middle one and the top left one are pretty good. Alright, this one, this one you need to focus for. 
<laughs> Ronald McDonald there's definitely gonna be two of my words bodybuilding contest here's the reveal Ronald McDonald in a bodybuilding competition <laughs> oh I was so close yeah you get four, four. another good round for me after round three seven. Oh, oh was it easier to guess Ronald McDonald in a bodybuilding competition versus Bernie Sanders at <laughs> Deepwater Horizon cleanup was that it, what did you get more points on Ronald McDonald bodybuilder hey, hey. Quit screaming at me. 12 to, oof, you're doing really bad. All right, well, fine. I'm throwing in another one then. This next one, this next one's gonna kick your ass, but your, yours goes first. Oh, you're right, you're right. Okay. Now this one is deceptively tough because could be kind of generic. But you're right, not like the obvious few... Danny DeVito at <laughs> Deepwater <laughs> Horizon. Shut up, I worked hard on that one. Oh my God, angry guy, angry business guy, angry yelling. Oh, come on, dude, this is just a stock photo. <laughs> Face palm Face screaming, palm. stock photo. That's five words, are you gonna lock that in? Yeah, I'm doing that, I'm doing that. Oh, okay, so we're just allowed to cheat. Wait, what did I say? Angry man screaming stock photo. All right, fine. You know what? Now, now, now I have a hard one. During the last round, I was like, all right, if you're gonna, if you're gonna play the game like that, now I'm gonna make up this one. And now you can know what it feels like to be on that end. Check this out. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's what it feels like. <laughs> oh, no. oh no, that's the guy from Rush Hour, isn't it? I don't know that actor's name. If that's the biggest of your concern, you are, you have no shot at this then. When I reveal this answer to you, you're gonna know what it feels like, how I felt the last three rounds dealing with your bullshit. <laughs> I hate you. I don't know this actor's name. I'm literally looking up Rush Hour right now. Okay, so now we're allowed to just research? I graciously give you the opportunity to win Just $5 say you wanted to keep the O'Reilly gift card. Say you bought just, it for you know yourself what? and don't do this whole a song and dance. Chris Tucker. That's that's who it is. It looks like The Office almost, like he's doing a break the fourth wall monologue. Chris Tucker, The Office interview. Now, let me get ready for the most Sven Johnson answer reveal ever. Chris That's Tucker trying to bite through corrugated <laughs> aluminum. <laughs> I, can see, I can see the corrugated aluminum. I actually it. came out pretty good. <laughs> I know. That's hilarious. Well, I get two points on that round. Mm, interesting. Only two points. Huh. It seems like the average amount of points I've been getting the last few rounds. <laughs> I hate you. I'm at 14, you're at 10. Going into the fifth and final round here, I have one for you. I, honestly, I don't know why I'm doing the fifth round with this one because it's one of the easiest prompts, but here you go. Is that a gibbon? You tell me. You tell me what oh, that so is. Oh, so we're allowed to Google, apparently, because you could Google Chris Tucker, right? Yeah, I, I will allow it. You know what? I will allow it. I just was going to say, remember, like, it's supposed to be five words. There are five words in each prompt. A couple of us got a little carried away. We did a little more than five words. A few you times did a words, you but... did a couple of more. You know what? We're not going to point fingers. And We're wait a second. Fingers. You gave me all that shit at the beginning of the game when you're like, it's supposed to be only five words and you've been using like That's 10 words per prompt. That's my tone. Five words, Ian. You, get five you have words. changed the rules of this game three <laughs> times. Hey, Sven, want to come be on my game show? That's what you texted me last. Oh, wait, no, that was me who texted you that. Ian, want to be on my game show? Want to come be on my game show on my channel? It is legal to buy yourself an O'Reilly gift card. You know that, right? Ian, what were the five words that I typed for this picture? Okay, okay, okay. All right, let's get back to business. He's doing like the Black Power pose, like the, the, the fist. So monkey, Black Power... Fist pose. Monkey black power fist pose is what you guess. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think I can get some points off that. Honestly, I'm kind of disappointed because this is quite obviously a very, very, very. <laughs> Shut <stinky> the fuck <laughs> <laughs> cannot look at that monkey and tell me it doesn't look very, very, very stinky. <laughs> so stupid. Ian, this is just getting farther and farther on your grasp, man. I never had a shot. You get one point for that round, an astonishing one point. Don't I feel like an idiot? Last round here. Did you turn your brain cells on? Here we go. Even though I don't really need to try. Ooh, Tom Brady. <laughs> okay. Tom Brady making out kid. Okay, well let's 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 see. Tom Brady mouth kissing his son. <laughs> Uncomfortable. <laughs> I got I got three though. I you got, got three. three. That's pretty good. After five rounds, I have that should be nineteen points for me. Ian, 
Kong finishes with 10, 11. Ugh. I want everyone in the comments to look back at how reasonable the answers I gave you were. I ended with the most basic prompt of all of my five, so I don't know what you're complaining about. Bonus round time. Bonus round is going to be special because it's going to be worth five times the amount of regular points. So if you guess five words correctly, that translates into 25 points. So technically, you could have a chance. <laughs> oh but this has a you have this has a very you're kind of making all this up on the spot sort of vibe. I'm going to be honest with you up until now. No, dude, I have been telling you about five pictures, five words. Bonus round is five times the points for a week. Since I saw Dolly Mini. No, you haven't. You told me about this like two days ago. Okay, okay. So which means I actually have a chance to to win now. You could, in theory, you could win right here because this is worth five times the amount of points, but I'm not going to let that happen. I've got a sizable lead. I'm going to keep that. So anyway. You mean you're not going to let that happen because you have a bullshit picture. W whoa. <laughs> you know, I wish. I, <laughs> honestly, I wish I had a bullshit picture because I saved maybe one of the most easily identifiable pictures for the bonus round. But we'll just okay. we'll, we'll get into it here. Oh, this is uh, oh, this what's it called? Uh, Mario Afghanistan. The Middle East war. F there's five words right there. I'm locking you in. It was Mario from Mario, except he's in Afghanistan. But that means I get two points for the Mario. You get Mario. Oh, wait. Yes! For a double up? Yes, it worked against you, finally. All right, this one's yours, okay? <laughs> Ooh, <laughs> peculiar. <laughs> Clearly it's JFK. That's what I'm saying. Normally, like, the AI fucks up the face, but I'm like, this one, it actually, you know. Okay, JFK. It looks like he's ghost riding the whip. It's oh, like... interesting. You know what? JFK, ghost riding the whip. JFK after that one awkward car ride. <laughs> 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 That's what I'm saying. It actually got it pretty good. Like with the... <laughs> Ooh, awkward. <laughs> That's what the doctor said when they brought him into the hospital. This, I'm sorry, Jackie. This is really awkward. <laughs> Damn, okay. I, get, I think I get one, JFK. So you get three... Which times right, five? That you said five five point bonus round something. Three times five. I get one times. Well, maybe. No. Which means I have so fourteen actually, points gonna, over you no. on the bonus round, no. right? We just which means we're not gonna do which the bonus actually round means that I could have. I won. Actually, right? Wait, wait. No, that's <laughs> whoa, crazy, dude. That's wild. Just dropped a call with Ian. Whew. That was weird timing. Well, I guess I win the $5 off O'Reilly card. So that was five pictures, five words, $5 off. Thank you guys for sticking around. I want to do this again. Maybe I'll make another video like this. I had a lot of fun. Ian, subscribe to Ian. I love him. He loves you. And get out of here. I hate you now. This video is sponsored by Brilliant. Brilliant, if you didn't already know, is the best way to learn STEM interactively. You can learn at your own pace and it's super versatile and interactive and fun. There are so many different lessons about different topics depending on your skill level. There's everyday math courses all the way up to neural networks. You can learn about neural networks in an engaging, exciting, interactive way. It's the best way to become brilliant. Brilliant's newest course is their everyday math course, which is great for me because I suck at math and I struggle with basic things like fractions and percentages. And that taught them to be in a super easy, interactive, bite-sized way. But you don't just have to be bad at math to use Brilliant. They've got so many different courses for a variety of different skill levels. Oh my God, just listen for once. To get started for free, visit brilliant.org slash Sven Johnson. That's right. I'm sponsored by a .org. Or just click the link in the description below. And the first 200 of you who do that will get 20% off Brilliant's annual premium subscription.